Hi, how are you? It's Travis in here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we cleared the dungeon Black Fathom Deeps and got a new staff and some new pants. Complete some quests as well. And today, we're going to be I'm listening. questing in Terran Mill. Doing some more quests here. We got some turtle meat. We guess we'll save that. Maybe we'll uh, make some food from that. We got some clam meat as well. Trust no Hello. Guess we'll open all that. All right, guys. So let's pick up some quests here. Let's check out this wanted poster. Wanted syndicate personnel. By the authority of Lady Sylvanus, all members of the organization known as the Syndicate are wanted dead. Those brought into custody or taken prisoner will be summarily executed. They are currently known to be amassing in the ruins of Dirthold Keep to the southeast of Terran Mill. A handsome reward is offered to all who bring proof of their deed to High Executor Darthalia. Kill 10 Syndicate rogues and 10 Syndicate watchmen. Return to High Executor Darthalia in Terran Mill for your reward. All right, so we'll do that. We'll have a chat here with Krusk. The rescue. Me and some of the other warriors were sent by the war chief to retrieve an object from Durnhold and to investigate this so-called syndicate. We went to the Durnhold to take a look around, but we were taken by surprise by a large number of humans. We fought bravely, but their sheer numbers were enough to defeat us. They took a few of us captive, but I was able to escape. Turnhold is just southeast of here, across the river. Jewel and Togthar are being held there. You must go and rescue them. We'll get a grunt vest for that. I won't replace our current vest, but... We'll get a recipe. Big bear steak. That's good. Alright, guys. Well, I am going to uh, head down there. And I'm also thinking about getting our cooking up since we're getting all these recipes. Our cooking's starting to fall behind a little bit, which is too bad. I think we can catch it up pretty quick. And I think we'll have a, a fishing episode pretty soon. I also forgot to do a level 19 BG. So I will be doing a level 29 one. So I think when I hit level 29, which may be today or, or next episode, we'll... Uh, do a little bit of fishing and then we'll do a battleground so let's head over to Durnhold here then there's this uh, mud snow blossom quest so maybe we'll do that as well we got over here Is there an ore over here? We probably missed it. Nope, there it is. Tin vein. Our bags are looking alright. Got a little bit of space. And it looks like Wrath is going to have even more changes now, guys. They have added, or they are going to add a new thing called Heroic Plus. And it's going to come out in Phase 2 of Wrath of Lich King. And I think that's kind of interesting. Because it's going to allow people with alts and, like, new people that want to catch up to catch up pretty damn easily. Because all of the gear from the from the previous uh, raids, like 10-man raids, you'll be able to get that in Heroic Plus. And then the 10-mans, the Heroic 10-mans, you'll be able to get all of the 25-man loot, or 25-man loot, from pretty much when the next phase happens. So, pre so here's an example. So Aldar comes out, Nax Ramus 25 gear will now be attainable in Nax Ramus 10 man. Hope that's easy to understand. And then all the gear from Nax Ramus 10 man will be attainable via Heroic Plus, which is a harder version of Heroic Dungeons. 
Oh, these, these syndicate guys are super low level. Are any of them, like, level... It's brutal. <laughs> I know all these guys are only level 20. Okay, so we'll try to get this done quick. I'm surprised they are only level 20. So we need to get rogues and watchmen. And then we gotta free some people. I actually did a dungeon about the of old Dirt Hold. Where you get to actually free Thrall, Thrall from prison here. It's one of my favorite dungeons in TBC. Alright, let's make uh, a little bit of food, a little bit of water. And I forgot to uh, get the, the keybind going for food and... Or the, the macro going for drink and eat at the same time. I'll get that going soon. I'm going to try to group all these guys up and just AOE them down. It's going to be the plan. And the, the whole idea behind this is to make, uh, for the Heroic Plus, is to make dungeons worth doing. Like later on in the game. Just a good thing. Oh man, this might not be that good. I think I'm gonna get wrecked here. We'll see what happens though. I'll try to do a little bit of AoE. I'm gonna get shadow bolted by this one guy. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Who is that guy? Like, just level 21 just shooting shadow bolts? <laughs> like, what the heck? I should've just ran. That was silly. Yeah, doing AoE farming against casters just doesn't work. We'll get rid of that caster. We'll try to group up everybody else. Tries those shadow bolts to that much damage. And they also said that tanks and healers, like if there's like a, you know, like a low Q of them, then there's going to be uh, rewards given out to uh, tanks and healers. Like mounts and, and pets and stuff like that. But these changes are going to be really good for... I would say alts. If you're if you're into playing a lot of alts, you can gear them up pretty damn quick. Got rid of them. Let's drink up and eat again. There's a copper ore near here. Yeah, it's just up there. And there's some rogues on the ground. I think this is where all the prisoners are, right? Yeah, burnished gold key. I think I guess we need that to uh, help the prisoners escape. So I guess we'll just jump down.
There's more than three here. I think what I could do here is we'll pull these, this guy, this guy, and this guy. Come here. Come here. Hopefully this works. There we go, that was a good way to level up. Okay, so we leveled up, guys. And piercing ice increases the damage done by your frost spells by 2%, so I guess we'll start leveling that up. And we got a couple of casters here. We're just going to have to deal with them. Oops. It's a caster in there. Casters really ruin AoE farms. Can't keep them together. Doesn't look like there's a key in here. I guess we'll fight this rogue though. You can't cast through, can he? No. <laughs> that really sucks. <laughs> I can just keep doing this. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so what do we need? Rogues? We need one more watchman and then a bunch of rogues, I think. Where's this key at? It says the keys. Oh, it could be inside. We gotta find Jailer. Okay. So maybe I'm in the wrong area. Looks like someone else is here. Doing some dirty work. Is that a blood elf? Yeah. Barrel of melon juice. Probably give this guy a little bit of intellect, even though he doesn't need it. Alright, so I don't think anything's really here. Rescue Drool, but I think we need the, the key. So we'll get the key first. And then we'll come down here and rescue him. It's too bad we're too high of a level for this spot. We're gonna have to leave Terran Mill soon. I think we're almost done with the quest there. So that's good. Got like a couple more to go. And then I guess we'll be moving on to other zones, guys. That will be the end of our our journey through the three main zones around Undercity. Oh, there's Togthar. Oh, 
Wow, that was big damage. Let's use a quick uh, evocate here. And we'll try to get Togthar out of his, uh, his little prison. It says it requires the key. Zog, zog. Get away from here, mage, or they'll just put you in chains as well. Where is the key to this lock? Merrigan, one of the jailers. He has the key to my bonds. Farewell. Okay, so I guess the jailer's inside. The thing is, the keep's all broken down. Like, where is this jailer guy? I guess he's up top. I hate these caster guys. Okay, we got two rogues coming up here. That's right. Keep going. Keep going. Where's this jailer guy? Not here. Supposedly he's right around here. The thing is, we're getting a bunch of wool cloth. Maybe he's down here? I think they probably killed him. So we're having trouble finding him. We got another BOE. We got a feral down here. Well, the key's clear clearly up top. There he is, Jailer Eston. Damn it. They killed him. <laughs> I knew they did. We should have killed him. What the heck? We gotta wait for him to spawn again. Might as well just wait, I guess. We'll, we'll do some AoE or something like that. Try to get some more wool. There's a caster over here we can cast on. Seems like we're getting some XP for this. There he is. Get him, get him, get him. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna pull this guy to you. It's about time we got that key. Alright, so let's free this orc. Probably have a drink, though. Actually, never mind. I, I gotta start using Evocate. We don't have it up yet? There we go, now we got it. What the heck? I we didn't pull the other guy. Jailer Mar Marlgan. He's got the golden key. 
was wondering who this guy was. So there we go. We got two of the jailers down. I wonder how they even live here. You know what I mean? Clearly they don't live here. There's like nowhere to live. So what did the syndicate do? They just live outside, I guess? I don't know, maybe live in the in the cabins? The weird thing is that is that the cabins are still up. I guess they got repaired. Because in uh in the dungeon, Escape from Durnhold, you actually blow up the cabins. So I guess they repaired them after. Alright, so let's rescue Togthar. Then we gotta rescue the other guy. Have you freed Drool yet? I don't know where he's being held. I will only slow you down. But no pink-skinned human will keep me from freedom. That's right. Okay, so we got the keys. Now we just gotta head over here. This is where Buddy is, I think. Oh, we still got to slave rogues. Wow. Not great enough. I think I'd run into you. There's a rogue in there. That's good. I should have done fireball. Kind of like fighting the casters. They barely do any damage. <laughs> Just counterspell their abilities. Okay, good. These guys are all... They're all melee, so we can just group them up. And then AoE them all down. Come on. You gotta get better waters. Hopefully get better ones soon. Okay, let's go here. Let's run out of here. Are we coming? Come on. Kill. Alright, see so we am down. It's awesome that we got Kona Cold now. Really helps with the AoE farms. Alright, so let's free Drool. See what he has to Lota. say. Do you mock me while I am unable to defend myself bound to this ball of iron? How can I free you? One of the humans has the key to this infernal contraption. Esten, I think they said his name was. Ah, it is good Strength. to be free of my bonds. Have you freed Togthar yet? The humans split us after our capture. Go on ahead without me. I will make my own way to Terran Mill. Alright, so there we go, guys. Did that. Now we need to slay some rogues. And we need five more. I don't think we can get another one off. Maybe. This is pretty good. It doesn't look like there's any casters here. So we'll do uh, an evocate. Get our man up quick. We'll group all these guys up. I'm just gonna make sure we uh, get this rogue here. Just run by these guys. Just get them all, get them all. Come on, group up. They just weren't grouping up, man. 
Oh, this is gonna be like a terrible blizzard. It's the problem with the sh with I think uh, the frost armor. Sometimes they're a little too slow, and they're hard to group up. So we need two more rogues. Hopefully they're over here. We'll at least get one over there. I think. Any rogues? Only one. Alright, we'll group these guys up again. Let me group them up. There you go. One more rogue, and we are done. This place isn't too bad for AoE farming, as long as you get rid of these uh, shadow mages. You can group up the rest. Check the, the camps here, maybe we can find a rogue. Is that a rogue? No, there's another shadow mage. Oh, they really don't want to give us rogues. Let's go to the back, see if there's any rogues in there. Any rogues in here? Doesn't look like it. I wonder why the rogues are so rare. Guess they're stealth. Can't see him. Maybe we'll find one up top here. It doesn't like look, look like there's any. Maybe we'll drop down into the back here. There's a rogue right there. Can we cast on him from up here? We can jump in with our horse. Yeah, you can. That's awesome. <laughs> Alright, the final rogue. We found him. The other guy's casting. Don't let him cast another spell. Oh my gosh, we're lucky we didn't die there. All right, well, we're finally done with that. Now let's get out of here. I'll have to eat and drink first, though. And then we'll head south and we'll get some of these uh, mud snow blossoms. And then we'll have those two quests turned in. And then we have the Battle of Hillsprat still, where we have to slay some blacksmiths and blacksmith Varrington. We gotta retrieve a shipment of iron and report back to Darthalia. So maybe we'll do that too. We'll have to go all the all the way back to the Hillsrad farm though. I wonder if the Syndicate and the Defias Brotherhood are connected. I don't think they are, but 
be surprised if they were. We finally made it out of Durnhold. Another drain eye shaman. Just cruising along. So how many mud snow blossoms do we need? I think we need six. Yeah. The Nathander Stead. It's a farm with a bunch of uh, gnolls. I guess they're guarding these mushrooms. How level are these guys? 26. That's kind of cool. Some of them are casters, though. Which is not very cool. The Mud Snow Knolls, I think they're okay, right? Which ones are the casters? The shamans. Okay, well, I guess we'll. Let's so we'll let me these guys down. Hey, okay, put a debuff on us called Sm Sling Mud. Chance to hit reduced by 50%. Hopefully that doesn't impact our spell to hit. Because it could. shaman there. If we get rid of all the shamans, we could probably do a d decent little group up. If I can kick that lightning bolt, there we go. I wonder if that melon juice is better than the water we currently have. 835? What's melon juice give? I'll leave the same. Yeah, 835. Not too great. Recipe, Elixir of Ogre Strength. Guess we could sell that on the auction house. Try to get as many of these mushrooms as we can. I think we can group... No, it's another shaman. Let's get rid of this guy. Is somebody mining over there? A yeah, torn death knight. Okay, so let's do one more drink and eat, and then we'll group up these three. And we'll get them all down, and then we'll hopefully be able to get this line of of mushrooms. Seems like there's four. Hopefully we don't die to all these guys. Could be tough, but I think we'll be all right. Let's get some more water. Sometimes I think the water's not even I think it's working, but I sometimes I think that's just my spirit. Okay, so let's uh group up this guy, group up this guy. Group up this guy. 
Get this guy. Bring them all around. Okay. Are they all grouped up? Okay, good. Well, I'm done. Hopefully this works. Let's see, right here is pretty good. One's getting away. He's gonna start coming back to us. Get him. Oh, that was close. I think we didn't die there. Well, we did it. We got all four of them down. Alright, so let's pick up the final four here. Well, now our inventory's full, what the heck? It's a nice chest. I'd say it's better than our chest and it's cloth. Uh, looks like we're gonna have to get rid of something here. Maybe we get rid of our, our food. Put on this new chest. And we got a belt. So we can get rid of our waters. And we'll sell all this junk. So we will be heading back to Terran Mill after this. Alright, so let's get on our mount. And we'll head back to Terran Mill. Maybe we'll find a couple of copper ores along the way. Maybe some tin. And our gold's going to be climbing up pretty fast soon, I think. Especially once we start gaining, uh... What the heck is that? Oh, now I'm lying. He's going to get out of his... It's no soon. Our frost bolts are really packing a punch now. I think they're better than our fireballs. Alright, so we got some more tin. That's good. Another thing we should do is probably get our engineering going. Maybe we'll do that next episode. After we uh, finish off a couple more of these quests. So let's sell some junk that we got. We'll check our mail too. We did have some auctions up. Hopefully we made a little bit of coin. What now? Excellent mage. At this rate, the syndicate nest will be rid from the land in no time. There's the Battle of Hillsbrad. I guess we'll do that later. Looks like we're opening up some more quests, though. So the humans thought to turn our warriors into slaves, did they? We'll show them. It would seem that they have taken Goldeer, our leader, to another location. We must find him and rescue him, but we currently have no clue where he is. When we have a lead, I will be sure to tell you, Travis. So we'll take that if we can. We don't damn our inventory. So let's go sell some stuff. Okay, gray. 
These wrists, we owe mutton chops, don't need that. Another BOE, melon juice, shiny fish scales. Holding on to all this food stuff because I think I'm going to use it, but we probably won't. Old chest, we get rid of that crawler. I'll probably have to get rid of all this stuff pretty soon. To do that, we'll have to do some engineering. Strength and honor. Dabu. And some cooking. Yeah, we're gonna have to focus on profession soon. Maybe we'll do that. Be quick about your business. Next episode. Where's that chest that we just got? There's the dwarven mild. We'll get rid of that as well. Farewell. Okay, so let's see. Oh, we got some sales. Jade sold. Yeah, a couple of the BOEs sold, which is good. Not bad. Made a little bit of coin. We're at 13 gold now. I am Any luck with Nathander Stead? Ah, the horrible reek of mud snout blossoms. At least those filthy knolls are good for something. Just when I thought another day was going to pass devoid of any joy, you brought me those marvelous mud snow blossoms. First, I will mix them down into a fine composite. We'll then need Master Apothecary Farinel in Understudy to apply his colloid of decay to it, and then we'll be ready for some good fun indeed. Here, take this mud snow composite and run it off to Master Farinel at once, Travis. Alright, so there we go. We got another quest to turn in in Undercity, so that's good. Yeah, guys, that is going to be the end of today's episode. Next episode, we may head to Undercity and focus a little bit on professions, or we may try to finish off a couple more quests in Terran Mill and Hillsbrad. But as always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.